What is up guys, Nimbus here, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. Today we're going to talk about a lot of things, so get ready. So I want to start this vlog off by saying some corny stuff, but uh, it's actually true. You got to chase your dreams. If you have anything you want to do in life, you got to go and tackle it. You got to try it, and you got to do... You know, you gotta go outside the outside your box and your little circle and uh, get uncomfortable and do things that you really uh, wouldn't normally do. And that's, most of the time, that's how you're gonna experience the greatest things in your life. Only reason I'm saying this is because uh, obviously with that Doug thing, what happened, I think that's really crazy. Uh, I'm happy for him, that's awesome. Uh, hopefully they can end up like being together. I think that'd be a crazy story for him. But uh, I think that's really awesome. So yeah, that's just a testament to chasing your dreams and tackling it and that's how I wanna start this vlog. We got a lot of stuff to catch up on. I don't think I've talked to you guys since X Games. And I've been lazy. So, like, I just haven't uploaded. I've just been lazy. Uh, I've been... there. I mean, I haven't just been sitting around the house, couch potato. I've been traveling um, X Games weekend. Uh, I went there with my friends. And then immediately after that, I got home on Monday. And then I left again Wednesday to go to Sweden. So I went to Sweden until Tuesday. And then I got home and I left on Thursday for uh, Columbus to go relegation. So um, I've really only been at home about four days in that span of three weeks, which is kind of hard to upload. And my laptop died on me. My MacBook will not let me edit any videos and it died on me. And I didn't want to really buy a new laptop because that's like $2,000 to like edit videos that I don't really make money off of. Because it's just not a smart investment to like invest something that you're really not making money off of at the time. But I do enjoy making videos. So I'm just going to start trying to make videos like the day before I travel to go on my channel and like schedule them. But yeah, so basically I just like being honest with you guys. Like you guys are just another one of my friends that I'm talking to. But yeah, so that's pretty much what happened. I just... I mean, I was lazy in the fact that I couldn't make a lot of videos when I was at home, and it, it really saddens me, and I hope that my growth continues, even though I stopped for a little bit, a couple weeks, because a couple weeks can bite you in that. So moving forward, uh, we picked up TJ Halley, as you guys know. Uh, I wanted to give you guys a little bit of insight of why we did that, and I know you guys may have seen the sharp video and stuff, but I want to tell you like my point of view. All right, so basically when that WrestleMania stuff was going down, we had a couple options. Uh, we could have waited for relegation to end and find a fourth from there, or we can just pick up TJ Halley right away and um, let things, you know, just uh, let things get better over time and see how uh, how good we are or whatever. Um, so we decided that TJ was definitely the, be the best fit for us because he's been placing well. Uh, they removed CTF and he's a great uplink player. So that gives us a lot of strength in the uh, one game type that people probably won't be practicing as much. And then our hard point, um, I think it'll get a lot better just for the simple fact that we'll have somebody pressuring the hill more. Um, that was something that we lacked, uh, was hill pressure, and now we have somebody who's going to be pressuring the hill more. So our hard point will definitely improve, and TJ is traditionally a search and destroy player, so it, we should get a lot better at search. He started playing search in Black Ops 2, and he's just been you know a top search player since then. So I think the only thing we'll really have a little bit of problems with is probably the hard point, and if we can iron that out, I'm pretty sure we'll be a great team, but I'm really excited for the league. Um, starts in seven days. They changed all the format and everything. It's 22 games now. So the league format has changed. It's 22 games, best of fives, one game a night. It's going to be over the same scale of time, except there's just going to be less games. So I really like this uh, new format. I think it gives you a lot of time to practice and get better with your team and prepare for matches. And I think it hypes up matches more now too. So I really like this new system. And they also added something where you can veto another team's host. So if you're playing a team and you really hit their host, I can just say, screw that, I'm not playing those two toast. And they can say the same thing to my host. So I really like that feature. That's really cool. It's gonna make the league a bit more fair. It'll never be fully fair because it's online, but it will make it a bit more fair. The next event is UMG Dallas. Now this event is gonna be a little bit weird just for the simple fact that there's no DLC and MLG added a bunch of DLC maps to the league. So we're gonna be playing the league with a bunch of DLC and then we're gonna go to Dallas and there's gonna be no DLC at all. So that event might not be a true reflection of who's the best team in the game, but I mean, I really think it'll be a rough idea of who's performing with their team. And that event's a big event. It's 40K, I'm really pumped for it. That event's in like two weeks and a couple days. So um, 
I plan on getting a lot of content there, no more laziness out of me, but I'm pumped for that event and you guys should be stoked for that one too. Right, I've been streaming a lot, uh, last night I streamed about 7 hours, so you guys should definitely check out my stream, mlg.tv slash nameless. Um, there should be a lot of new uh, streams coming out, new streams, there should be a lot of streams coming out, uh, me just playing tournaments and eights and stuff like that. I played two tournaments last night, then we went one for two and uh, an eight series. So, um, played for a while last night, gonna be streaming again tonight, so make sure you guys are there. It'll be a daily thing every day every night i'll probably be doing it in the mornings too because i wake up early for some reason i'm just always up in the morning now i can't sleep past like 10 o'clock i have this like weird problem where i just wake up and then i just stay up and then i get really really tired at like a certain time at like four and then i just like power through that and then i'm like able to stay up all night i don't know it's really weird but um Anyways, I'll be streaming a lot, probably randomly here or there, like throughout the days, but it'll be a lot. So make sure you guys uh, keep that bookmarked, mlg.tv slash nameless, and um, I'll be live playing with subs probably like a couple hours after this video. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I haven't uploaded in a little bit, so I just really wanted to update you guys on a lot of stuff, bring you up to speed on what's going on in my life. And yeah, so... Um, Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'm out. Peace.